Hi there guys, it's Dave from Horizon Fish Keeping and today we're doing a, a video about will it hold water? So basically we got this tank for nothing off Facebook Marketplace um, we we're about a mile away from the house so I just thought go for it, go get it um, and we've cut out the silicon uh, give it a bit of a clean up and re it with the HA6 from Bondit uh, this is on Amazon. I think you're about nine pounds or I don't know, twelve dollars, something like that. It's usually a little bit more in dollars. Um, and we're gonna water test this today, and it's gonna be a shrimp tank. Uh, we're gonna scape it out uh, with the fluval stratum. Do a substrate uh, technique where you uh, layer it up with gravel, uh, fluval on top, um, and then we'll do like an aquascape in there. But if you subscribe to the channel, you'll see a second part of that anyway. So um, hopefully, you click subscribe. I want to say welcome back to all my subscribers from 2022. Um, we had a good year last year. Um, to say we'd only been going for about two or three months. Um, we ended up with uh, 90 subscribers. Um, and we, in December, I think we hit about 17,000 views, which is awesome. Um, you know, thanks for the support. And um, I enjoy, you know, making these videos. And hopefully we'll have more videos to come. Um, it's nice. It's just a nice thing for me to do. Uh, when the kids are around and the wife's not around and it, you know, it just gives me something to do as well. So we're going to fill this thing up with water and hopefully it doesn't explode all over my kitchen and whatever else could happen. I'll just leak. Um, I'm farm wall tiler, so I silicon every day. Um, so I'm pretty decent at that. I did the freehand method rather than the tipped round sort of thing. Uh, just because I, I silicon all the time is part of my job. Uh, so. We're going to stick you on the time lapse and see how we get on. Hopefully, it didn't explode. So, here we go. Now, then, you lovely people. Right, so we've filled up the aquarium and it's not pissing all over my kitchen floor, which is always a good sign. So what we're going to do next is um, the next part of this um, video will be doing the scape. So if you'd like to subscribe to my channel, that would be perfect. And then you can watch the second part because it'll pop up on your notifications. Mint. So now we've got water in there. Uh, we might as well just add fish. Just put fish in. Be right. Don't worry about it. So <laughs> anyway, now it's holding water and it's not everywhere, which is a good thing because I don't have to tidy up my kitchen. And um, I'm in the good books for the missus. Perfect. Um, we're gonna have a look at doing the four foot tank. So I'll, I'll show you the four foot tank in a second because um, I'm wanting to move my cichlids across um, and, chuck, and get some discus in my tank that's got my cichlids in. Um, but this were a bit of a trial run just to make sure that um, yeah, this stuff were decent. We've still got a bit of time yet, I suppose. Uh, but we're just checking out the sealant that from Bondit with the HA6, which I might do a bit of a review on as well just to stick on my channel uh, it's quite easy to use as I said before I'm flying wall tiles so silicon's like second nature to me I do it all the time um, so we can um, we can do the four foot tank now with, with this sealant hopefully I might just run this for a few weeks just make sure obviously there's a lot more weight with the four foot aquarium because it's got a hell of a lot more water in it um, so I just want to make sure this stuff is going to start peeling around edges or all like that uh, if it does hold up quite well you know, over a month or two months or whatever, then there'll be that video coming up as well. So we'll have the um, the shrimp tank that will be getting planted out and scaped, and then we'll be doing the four foot aquarium, which will get planted out and scaped. The cichlids will move across then, and then hopefully um, I'm gonna pull out all the plants and probably most of the rock that's in the cichlid tank as well, move over to the four foot aquarium, and then I might do a different scape. Well, we'll do a different scape then, um, and get some discus going in, in the other tank then. So you need to stick around and subscribe, that's the main thing. Um, a lot of people are watching my channel, um, getting loads and loads of views. I think last last month in December, so we're in 2023 now, so this is January. Um, in December, um, I got 17,000 views um, and about 10 subscribers. So there's a massive difference. Um, there's loads of likes going on there, so I'm assuming people are liking my videos, they're just not pressing that subscribe button, or maybe people are just watching, they're not signed in, who knows. But um, if you can just like my channel anyway, you know, uh, sub sorry, subscribe to my channel anyway, it just, it, it makes me want to make more videos, it means people are liking my content, 
um, and it pushes me to make more videos and I really enjoy it. I enjoy doing the videos. It's something to do when I've got some spare time at home and the kids are here and the wife's not here. Um, and, I, and I love the fish as well and my pets and stuff. So um, yeah, subscribe. Anyway, let's get back. I'll show you the four foot tank um, and then I'll probably just do like an outro, some mad madness and then um, you'll have subscribed anyway. So you'll be able to see my next video. Nice. It's a bit of a trial run for this tank, so this is the four foot aquarium. This will be the home for the cichlids, which are just there. Um, so these guys will be moving across to this tank. Uh, this is just one that I've got set up in my uh, in my bedroom under my TV, so I've um, got a few breeding tanks underneath as well. But the, the cichlids will be going into the four foot. Then I'm hoping I might just get some uh, some discus put into this tank here. So these guys are pretty shy during the day, but there's about ten fish in there. And there's one just about there you can see. Um, usually I tap, if I tap lightly on the glass, I think they're going to get food, so they'll come to the top. But so then guys, the conclusion to this uh, video was get some more subscribers, press the like buttons, and just get more people on my channel so I can make more bit videos and do a better deal, and it'll be mint for everyone. But anyway back to the video what we're gonna do is um, we're gonna now we know the tank can hold water um, or water wherever you're from um, we're gonna do escape on the uh, shrimp tank now so the next part of this video will be um, sticking out the you know doing the substrate system uh, doing the root tabs planting it out getting some shrimp and um, having a nice tank that's the idea so like share subscribe um, come and see some more of my other videos and uh, I'll catch you on the next one. Peace! Better get this bloody water out of here, aren't we? Get it escaped. There she goes. Outro done.